Hey guys, Danica here, um, Vegan Picker. Um, today's GIMP tutor tutorial, um, which is number five, uh, I had someone message me this morning, well, this afternoon. Um, you know, they're making their first shirt right now, and they need to know how to change a letter. Um, and my assumption being, because layers was mentioned, my assumption being they've moved on to a new layer and um, they don't know how to uh, go back um, to a different layer. I'm assuming there was a, a, a typo or something. So we've got our background here. And um, to go between layers to change stuff, be in layers... Um, see how there's these different things here? Um, you know, this is how you undo, like, like if you want to go back to a layer and get rid of everything below it, that's in this. See how it says undo? Okay. So, text. We're going to go click our text tool. We've got our font size correct. We have the font that we want to use. If we want to change the color, right here. Okay. Um, I'm going to make uh, another video, uh, probably should be up today, to tell you a few ways to change the color. But, okay, so let's, let's, let's create a typo. So, we're going to do, you know, we think we're doing like 7 and, uh, you know, 42. Um, sorry, I, I have a lot of things running right now. I probably shouldn't while I'm doing this, but, um, all right, so we got that, uh, and then we're moving on to our next text layer, okay? And we're like, ah, dude, this is so not how you spell seven. So we come over here, and we look up here, and we're on layers, okay? Well, here's the layer that has our mistake, all right? So we're going to go here. We're going to click back in the text box, delete the offensive letter, put in the correct one, and we're done. That's it. You just click back and forth here. Now if you were over here, that would be a different story because you would lose the layer below everything that you went back to. See here? Um, this is the text layer for seven. Now if I click that, see? It deletes everything that, it undoes everything below it. Now we still have where we fixed it and stuff, but if you were to go here and change it, then you are more than likely going to lose everything below. Uh, and that's it, guys. That's, I mean, that's it. It's that simple. You just find the layer over here. Find the layer that you messed up on, click in it, and fix it. And then carry on with your bad self. Uh, I hope that was helpful. Um, if not, let me know. I will try to, you know, tell me what you didn't get, and I'll explain it further. So thanks for watching.